In this video I'll show you how to disable notifications on your Android phone at night when you're sleeping so you don't receive notifications every time you get an email or a text message or someone tries to call you so your phone is silent so you can have a good sleep especially if you have many apps that give you notifications like a YouTube video someone published a YouTube video at night there is no reason to up, uh, wake up to watch that video so for this reason, I will show you how to set the schedule for do not disturb. To change notification settings and set the do not disturb and do not disturb timer, go to the settings, open the settings up. And here in the settings up, you have notifications, one of the main areas, one of the first options. And there are lots of options where you can restrict some apps to have limited notifications or no notifications at all. But if you don't want to have any notifications at night and you wouldn't want to because you're sleeping, you don't care if you received an email or there's a YouTube video published, you can watch it in the morning or the next day. And what's important here, you have the do not disturb option. So on the do not disturb option here, you can allow some people to interrupt you. You can also allow, if you get a phone call, the second call it will go through, it will be allowed if it's something important, someone is calling multiple times. And also you can allow people, some people you can allow to always disturb you if there is a call or a message. You can allow specific apps to interrupt, so if you receive messages that are important, you will be able to hear them and receive the messages. Alarms and other interruptions. These are, the, these are the settings you can have and I would choose alarms all the time because you always want to be able to allow alarms. I media mean, yeah, sounds, you want to play a video maybe while you're watching, uh, you're watching a video and you have the do not disturb on and reminders. I can turn on the do not disturb now and you know that do not disturb is on by looking at this, there is this forbidden sign, like the stop sign there. See like circle with a minus in the middle, that's the do not disturb is on. Do not disturb is on, I can turn it off now. But the best way to use do not disturb at night when you don't want notifications to bother you, you can easily set schedules. So I have here one schedule, I have one timer from Monday to Sunday from 10 at night until 7 in the morning. And this schedule will set the do not disturb on from 10 until 7. And I can add one more, I can add another schedule at different times. And this is going to set the do not disturb on. That's what it's doing. You can also make the phone silent from your volume buttons up and down here next to the power button. So power button, volume button up and down. So when you set this, you can have the option to set it to mute or vibrate only. I think that's what it means. I'm not sure about that one. So it's mute now. So now we have do not disturb and mute. It's two at the same time. Maybe it's too much to have them like this. If do not disturb is off, but I have this option that it's vibrate only. I think that's what it means this one. And turn off the sounds. That will also not allow calls to go through and notifications. But most of the time you want for at night to have automatic schedules like this, to set it automatically and you don't think about it, but you will know about it. You will see that little circle with the minus, the like the stop sign on the phone and you know the phone is in uh, do not disturb mode. This is really useful so you can get a good sleep. So you have energy for the next day and you're not constantly half waken up by notifications. You might not even no wake up, but notifications will disturb your sleep and you wouldn't even know it, but you will be tired the next day. Thanks for watching.